A man whose job, he says, is to spy on truck drivers is now accused of trying to kill one. Good evening, I'm Calvin Snead. I'm Kim Chapman. The incident happened in 2010, and the case is finally making its way through the Hamilton County court system. Micaiah Thurman joins us now with the story. Micaiah. It's a job you don't hear every day. Joseph Valpe records truck drivers and catches them driving dangerously. But police say Valpe is the dangerous one who caused trouble while filming a trucker back three years ago. 46-year-old Joseph Volpe sat silently in Hamilton County Court with his lawyer by his side. He faces several charges for a shooting back in 2010 after an altercation while on the job. Mr. Volpe is licensed to carry a gun. He has a carry permit. He had one at that time. Volpe's from Chickamauga. His job is to observe truck drivers and catch them in the act of dangerous driving. But on June 30th, 2010, one truck driver says he took his job a little bit too far. Is this something that you've made up to bolster your story? Joseph Johnson says Volpe was filming him while driving down Interstate 24. When Johnston figured out what Volpe was doing, Robinson says he tried running Volpe off the road. But Mr. Johnston gave him the one finger salute. But the truck driver and his attorney say that's when the situation turned violent. And fires at the back of the cab of the 18-wheeler while it's driving down the ridge. The shot goes from the back cab portion, not the trailer, the back cab portion between the trailer and the actual cab of the truck through um, the back sheet metal, through the sleeping area, which is there behind the seats, up through the uh, near the headrest of the driver's seat. And parts of the incident caught on tape. Four zero eight zero. The defense maintaining that Volpe was not the shooter. Here's a ridge cut. There's a four street exit. He said he heard a shot. Now this right here is a East Lake Courts. A fairly common place for shootings. He didn't see Mr. Volpe shoot. Volpe is facing charges for reckless endangerment, aggravated assault, and attempted second-degree murder.